Okay. Now these are pretty translucent, pretty tender. So you're going to sprinkle in a quarter cup of flour. And give it a good mix around. Mix it around. Okay. Now you're going to put your little powder, salt and pepper to taste. A little salt. Teaspoon. Then, you've got all that in there, you're going to add in your dill, just sprinkle about a tablespoon. You're going to put in two cups of chicken broth, and you're going to give that a mix up. And then I got a cup of heavy whipping cream. Now you just let that cook around. Voila. And one of the main ingredients that I love is some minced garlic. Don't measure, I just plop a bunch in there. The more the merrier to me. I'm a garlic lover. So you're gonna let that thicken up. Okay. Let this thicken up. I got it on medium high. Vinny's over there jabbering away in the background. Yeah, he can't be let out because if I let him out, he'd be in the pot. He's a very nosy little guy. He wouldn't be hungry because all he does is eat. <laughs> He's whistling. Hello, Vinny. Boy, Mama gets done cooking, you can get out, okay? I got my oven heating to 400. It's already starting to get thick. thick. It's very easy to make. If anybody likes chicken pie, like I do. What would be called chicken pot pie? And for my crust, when I get ready to do it, I just got a couple, a box of the pie cr uh, crust. And I cut them in strips. I'll show you when I get to that part. Smells so good. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put my chicken in here. Like I said, I cooked up. I got about a, a little bit over a pound of chicken. Pack. What? Let all those just marry around together. I think cooking is easy. It just takes patience and time. See all that goodness in there? Mm. I'm going to thicken it while it bakes, too, so it's no big deal. There's your 
There's your innards here. Now, let's take, I'm gonna relocate the camera over here. Oh boy, I'll be on camera. I'll tell you something else that makes your house smell amazing. People buy all these smelly stuff and all that. I got this little small you can see it, crock pot. It's just a little $10 one I got. And, um, let's see if I can get you down here more. And I put different stuff in it. Cause Vinny, he can't be a, around a lot of smells. So I keep him pretty clear of all that stuff. So I, right now I've just got water and a little, cost a dollar. I think it was at my local grocery store for these little cinnamon sticks. And I put those in here and put water in here, turn this on high and it makes your house smell amazing for a dollar. And it's all natural. You could put anything in it. I put, what did I put in it before? I put, I put oranges, I put apples. Um, I put, uh, I put cloves. Actually, I put some cloves in there right now. I put some cloves. They got a very strong smell. I put anise in, anise in it. A lot of different seasons you can put in it. So, but it makes your house smell amazing. I smelled it all night last night when I was in bed. Now you're just going to pour this in your 9 by 13 pan. This pot is pretty heavy. Okay. Pour that in there. And now, something I don't have is a lot of room. Now, I just cut the two pie crust in strips. See the strips? And I'm just going to lay it on there. Should be amazing. It may not take them all. I think about just laying right on top of each other though, because the crust, come on, it's the best part, right? So. Arrange it any way you want to. It don't have to be perfect. It's just me and my husband eating it, so. And that's all. You're about done. It's easy to make. So easy. So, so easy. Nice. This is actually my first time making it. <laughs> but it is easy. Isn't it, Vinny? Really, I hate to waste this. I'm just going to kind of lay it around. Beat up an egg and just, oh, well, put it on top of it. 
just made a mess. Don't like making messes. Just brush a coat on top of it. Give it a nice shine. Then I got my oven at 400 and bake it. Probably everything's cooked. Just got to cook the crust basically. In about 30 minutes or so. Probably. We'll just check on it. There we go. Got it all good and coated. We'll do some videos with Vinny. I know Vinny has a lot of fans on here. He's such a good bird. There we go. Looks good. Okay. I'm always washing my hands. Okay. So, now you're just going to put this in the oven. And when it gets done, I will take a picture of it. When I take it out in about 30 minutes. Alexa. Set the timer for 30 minutes. 30 minutes. And that's all you do. And I'll take a picture of it and I will put it as a thumbnail and show you what it looks like. Well, see, I wasn't in the camera too much. Okay. I love y'all. Y'all have a great day. And we'll see you soon with more videos. Bye.